about animals. Are there many animals or birds where you live? Well, as you read now, I don't have any animal in my house, but you know, in the past, I um, grew a cat. And how often do you watch programs or read articles about animals? Well, you know, when I work, I, I usually see uh, some uh, documentary about animal in Discovery Channel, you know. But now I I think I don't have uh, enough time to see. Have you ever been to a zoo or a wildlife park? Uh, yes, of course, but it's also when I will try because um, uh, you know, uh, last time um, I went to Thao Cầm Viên um, and some and some zoos in Hanoi, and I saw a snake or tiger or elephant in uh, this place. Would you like to have a job working with animals? Well, um, actually, I think I I am not uh, susceptible to do anything uh, about anymore um, because you know uh, the job, uh, the my favorite job is uh, something like business uh, or marketing or human resource. All right. Now let's move on and talk about health. Is it important to you to eat healthy food? Of course, uh, you know, when uh, I eat um, some healthy food um, on diet, on my diet, uh, I can lose weight and it's um, also, it is also healthy for um, treat some disease about the lungs or the heart. So if you catch a cold, what do you do to help you feel better? Um, in, um, in my opinion, I think uh, I can do uh, some exercise uh, on the mornings or have some uh, diet to help my uh, my body and my health to improve better and better. So, do you pay attention to public information about health? Yes, um, every day I spend about um, you know. Uh, 20 minutes to search uh, Facebook or uh, Google to find uh, something about uh, healthy food and some research to cook uh, healthy food. Mm -hmm. What could you do to have a healthier lifestyle? Mm. Well, firstly, I think I will try to do exercise in the morning, you know, and after that, uh, I think I will eat, uh, follow as uh, my diet. Mm. Now, let's move on and proceed to part two of our practice. In this part, I'm going to give you a topic and you've got two minutes to talk about this. But before that, I'll give you one minute to think of what you're going to say. So your topic is to describe a website you use that helps you a lot in your work or studies. You've got one minute to think of what you're going to say.
All right, one minute is up. Yes. Now you've got two minutes to talk about that topic and don't worry if I stop you. You can begin talking. Uh, yes, so, well, I will talk about a uh, website. I think it's uh, helped me a lot when I uh, learned uh, English. You know, this is a website, uh, I assignment, you know. Um, this website, um, on the, this website, uh, designed to general, um, you know, um, but, uh, you know, uh, this website helped me to uh, learn about IL and uh, from uh, from the day I know this website, my English skill was uh, improved uh, better and better. And, um, you know, um, it's also the way writing skill. I know that um, um, Simon is an uh, examiner and uh, some uh, some, I think, uh, I mean, some uh, example about the writing skill in this website is really, really helpful for me to uh, practice my skill. All right. Is that all? Yes. Okay, so let me ask you a few questions before we proceed to the next part, okay? So, uh, would you ever recommend this website to other students learning IELTS? Well, um, I think um, Simon, IELTS Simon is the um, best uh, website and Besides uh, this website, I have some website like mini test or IL online test. It's a uh, very really, um, help, helpful or useful for students to learn to look. All right. Okay, now let's move on to the third part of the test. So I'm just going to ask you some general questions related to the topic that you just talked about. So I'd like to ask you about the internet. Yes. Why do some people find the internet addictive? You mean addictive like... Um... Like why are some people so crazy about the internet? Oh, yeah. Um, well, um, personally speaking, um, internet is, um, you know, um, is a social, big social media uh, in that uh, a lot of people can find the uh, big information about many such as, um, and I think, um, now have a lot of people they um, use uh, internet too much and they find some information I think is uh, not true mm -hmm. but what do you think life would be like or the world would be like without the internet can you reverse the questions what would the world be like without the internet? Uh, yes. um, I, I believe that if uh, our life uh, don't have internet, um, this is uh, this world can be uh, can develop uh, better and better because um, internet have. Uh, a lot of things become faster than um, ever before, you know, and um, 
I think um, internet also uh, is also a tool to find and um, search uh, some particular information. So do you think that the way people use the internet may change in the future? Well, actually, uh, about this uh, problem, I don't have uh, many uh, information. Uh, but uh, in my opinion, I think um, in the future, people uh, people should to change the some method to search uh, the to search in the internet because uh, now in the internet have a lot of uh, mislead uh, knowledge and it is very dangerous if uh, young people to learn to insert some to insert this information. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's move on and talk about social media websites. What are the ways that social media can be used for positive purposes? Can you repeat the question? I can hear you. Okay, what are the ways that social media can be used for positive purposes. Uh, well, you know uh, about social media like Facebook or Twitter. I think this is a um, community to, to connect uh, people in the world. Uh, you know, in a family app, uh, there are some members uh, live who live uh, far from the, their family. I think social media will uh, connect them with uh, their family. Mm -hmm. Are there any negative impacts that social media brings to people? Uh, yes, uh, you know, social media, uh, in social media, I know that um, there are a lot of information. This uh, that's uh, not true. Um, you know, uh, so if a uh, kind or children they read some uh, con this content, I think uh, they will copy and sing uh, about them and it's uh, very dangerous for the uh, for the development of the children. Mm -hmm. Finally, uh, as you know, nowadays a lot of companies are using social media to promote their products and services. Do you think that it will continue to happen in the future? Uh, you mean some company use social media? Yes, to advertise their products or services. Do you think it will continue in the future? Uh, yes, uh, but um, you know about advertise. Uh, I think have some uh, small company use it uh, in the Facebook. All right, so we're going to have the second round of speaking practice. And if you, you still, if you have your phone with you, I suggest that you also record this round of practice so that you can listen to your answers later and you can assess your performance. <laughs> 